Alrighty, Rue, everyone. Welcome back to more Resident Evil. We're finally going to make some progress now that I've figured out how to use games and stuff. But you know what? We, we got there. So, uh, wrecked ship. Mia walks the debris-ridden landscape and finds Ethan lying on the ground, but he's taken away suddenly by a giant black blob. She then falls after into the wrecked ship. Yes, okay. So, <sighs> limited on ammo. I think we got some bombs now. And then we just got a whole bunch of um, chemical fluid or whatever the fuck that stuff is that disintegrates the locks. So, been using that. And we know that Mia is carrying a tissue sample of the little girl Evelyn, which I think is supposed to make something so we can destroy her, but we'll see. Okay, what are we at? Yeah, we're not in terrible shape. Need to find a storage bin at some point in my life. But. Okay. Go to the bottom level and save Ethan. Okay. Now that we have an elevator working, we can just take the, the Ellie. anything for this um wait yeah I'll go up to hold on what was that yeah I'll go up to the second floor real quick to check my crate get some stuffs this is gonna be a whole lot of bastards down there I need to fight this way Gunpowder. Um, I'll make another Healy. Yeah, and then I could make some strong stuffs if I wanted to. I may as well. What the heck, you? Cool. Okay. We're good. We're good. We're rolling. Okay, now down to S2. Here we go, baby. Coming, Ethan. Waiting. I know. I'm coming. Spice. I don't like you. Oh, no, no, don't touch me. Don't touch me. No, I did not consent. Get off me. Give me my bombs. I just don't have time. Yes, please do. Bitch. <laughs> Give me that machine gun ammo. Give me that machine gun ammo. Give me all these bombs. I'm bombing everybody. If my FBI agent is listening to this, don't worry. I mean in the game. Oh good, another one. Okay, I got coffee. Oh, mid jump. How's it feel to be a loser? Just curious.
BB, come on down here, BB. Spicy. You got in here. The coin. Hey, that's something. If if will like it. Can't decide if I should go ahead and heal or not. Yes, boss. Uh, why am I in here? Why am I down here? Where am I going, Cotton Eye Joe? Oh, that's a door. Oh. Okay. Evelyn. Evelyn. Patience is wearing real fucking thin. Ooh. Ethan. Ify boy. Don't worry, I've got some magical juice. I'm gonna dump it on you and you'll feel Ethan. better. Ethan? Shit. Hey, shh, shh, shh. I know, I know, I know. I'm not gonna hurt you. Hell, I never would have if I could've helped you. What do you mean? I'm no killer, son. Neither is Marguerite. No my boy, Lucas. Or even Zoe here. She did this. What the hell is she? Now, what did she do to you? She infected us with her gift. That's what she calls it. I found her near a busted out tank in the bayou. Everything changed after that. So she infects you and then she takes control? No. Not exactly, son. She just, she forces her way into your mind, your soul. You can't fight that. You are connected to her, and you can't resist the urge to. Oh, you're, you're a different person after that, mm. just like me. So Mia sent me that message because of Evelyn. Listen, uh, the girl just wants a family of her own. Just She's a little confused on how to get that. All right, you find her, you stop her. Ethan, free my family, please. away from him. Why? He doesn't love you. I can make him love you. Don't. Don't hurt him. Silly, I told you I'm not gonna hurt him. Don't you dare. So what? <laughs> You're not my mom. Remember? Much longer. 
No. Jeez. I'm filing for divorce the second we get out of here. No. No. Mia! No! Okay, what do we got on us? Just this. Okay. Okay, you little bitch. What the fuck are you? Ooh! Language, this is a Christian household, good sir. Oh, <laughs> big smart. Wait, what? It's your fault. It really kind of feels like it's not, but okay. <laughs> Tug right now. Oh, she just like <gasps> sat it down next to me. Oh my gosh, so cute. One day, if I ever add a camera to this channel, I'll have to show Lay Puppy. Cause she's awfully cute. It makes up for her being a demon almost. Abercrombie salt mine, South Duvet. Abercrombie and Finch. Uh, February 18th, 1892. There was a collapse in the Patterson mine. Tuon and Beckford are dead, and Huxley will never walk on the stone again. Old Man Stan was right. The ground there is too unstable. February 19th, 1892. The company's not going to send us any replacements. They want us to work double shifts instead. Can't wait to get back to the old country. Uh, I see not much has changed in America. So you're gonna pay me extra to do other people's jobs? No. Are they watching us from that helicopter? Are my stuffs in there? Stuffs. Okay. Ah, okay, let's do that. And do that. I want a shoddy. Want my machine gun. A burner. Um, how much shotgun ammo do I actually have? Because if I don't have much, it really may just not even be worth it. Handgun ammo. Handgun ammo. Okay, let's load up some guns. Okay, I don't have any extra flame fluid. Oh, yeah, I do. Or do I? I don't remember. Okay. Uh, I don't have any enhanced handgun ammo over there, do I? some of that over, bring some burner fluid over, bring some first aid over. Jesus, there's so much shit I need to bring over. And then real quick, I'm gonna... Yeesh! All that goodies! I have a locket. I have a bunch of coins. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And then... Let's see. What's that? Kickback stocking power. Stabilizer reloading speed increases. Oh, this is the one I was saving up for. A mag. How much mag ammo do I actually have? Three. Yeah, it doesn't seem worth it. I didn't think that was the other one. Psycho stimulants. I must never use those. Store. Just go ahead and get that one.
This is Bravo One. Do you read? This is Alpha One. Report. Did you find anything? A thorough search of the Baker property revealed zero survivors. Repeat, <laughs> zero survivors. We did find evidence of a skirmish. <laughs> Evelyn? Say. Negative. However, we did find several encrypted messages from the Baker's son, Lucas, to an unknown third party. You can probably guess who that was. That's just great. We've had reports using the abandoned mine south of the property. I'm gonna oh. go have a look. Roger that. We'll meet you at those coordinates. If you encounter Evelyn, orders are shoot to kill. Repeat, shoot to kill. Fantastic. Take down Evelyn. Sheesh, here we go. of a bitch. Yeah, I hear you. You're not sneak snuffing up on me. No! No, 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 bitch! Ooh, missed like a million shots, but like we got there. Sean Campbell. But I hate to use my bullet on this, but here we are. Burn our bullet. Probably should have brought my knife with me, but here we are.
Yeesh. Man, I would love some shotgun shells, my dude. I do like these bombs. Yes. What are you <gasps> Noise. Shotgun is really the only buddy boy meant for them. Son of a biscuit eating bulldog. Is there a trip there I didn't see? Friday, January 16th, 2015, 12.42 a.m. Thanks to you guys, it's been about a week since my head's been clear and back to normal, and she still thinks she's got me. You guys really need to work on fixing that. Not only does she look like a little kid, but she's about as stupid as one, too. Mom and Dad are still totally under, though. I was wondering, is this whole family obsession something you guys programmed into her? It's kind of fucked up. Friday, November 4th, 2015, 20, 10 a.m. That bitch Mia is still somewhere in between Evie, La La Land, and reality. She gets pretty violent, so I locked her up in a cell. Wait a second. I thought maybe Evelyn would get mad since Mia's her favorite and all, but she doesn't seem to care. She actually goes and visits her sometimes. She thinks Mia's her mommy. Like I said, your bioweapon is fucked up. Evelyn's family obsession is getting out of hand. She's making everyone kidnap more and more assholes off the streets to add to her freak show of a family. Maybe she's getting tired of me and not coming around. But it's a pain in the ass for me because I gotta clean up the mess whenever someone new comes along. Holy shit, is this Lucas's diary? By the way, Evie's looking sick or something. Her skin is getting all wrinkly and she's getting gray hair. Is that supposed to happen? It's like she's getting old all of a sudden. Yeesh.
This report details the symptoms that appear when the bacterium grows inside the E-series, infects a, inside of the E-series infects a human. Be sure to read this document thoroughly before dealing with E-series weaponized assets, hereafter referred to as mold. Initial infection. The mold ingests nutrients from the subject's body to propagate itself and slowly takes over cells within the body. As a side effect of this, the infected subject gains remarkable regenerative abilities. During experiments, we removed arms and legs from test subjects and found that they were able to co uh, co-apt the amputated limbs in a, ma in a matter of minutes. Mid-stage infection. Once the mold reaches the brain, the subject's thoughts become in tune with those of the E-series asset. The subjects start to hear things and experience hallucinations and soon come under complete control of the E-series asset. If the state continues, the host will lose all sense of ego. Complete infection. After every cell in the body has been taken over by the mold, the subject begins to lose their human form. Physical mutations differ from case to case, but all result in him or her acquiring incredible physical strength. Containing a subject at this stage would be extremely difficult. Yeesh. Five minutes after dose vomiting. Twelve minutes after dose cell calcification. Cell calcification. E necrotoxin E series dosage test. Ten minutes after dose death. Evelyn's functions also include the ability to form organisms from mycelia, the fungal filaments. The term organism is used loosely here. Strictly speaking, they are superorganisms formed of countless mycelia. What's important, though, is that they exhibit a strong survival instinct and will defend themselves ferociously with the slightest provocation. Their fungal toughness and remarkable strength give them significant battle p battlefield potential. The researchers have been calling these superorganisms the molded, made of mold, and also molded as in shaped. The name has a certain elegance to it. For the treatment of accidental infections, performing redacted on samples of Evelyn's body tissues produce, produces a unique fungicidal serum. Administering the serum to an infected subject will cause the mycelia to calcify, but if the subject's cells are already largely invaded, the serum will be fatal. Okay, so that's why it worked on Daddy Jack there. Since the treatment window is so small, the serum's primary use is therefore disposal of infected subjects rather than a cure. If explore, in exploring the serum's potential, we found that subjecting it to blank would enhance its effects to extreme potency, becoming a compound we now call e-neurotoxin, which blank in even tiny amounts. What's been interesting to observe in Evelyn's behavior is her obsession with the concept of family. In experiments, we found on multiple occasions that infected subjects were compelled to act as her mother or father, treating her as if she really were their daughter. Why did she settle upon family as the theme for her mental control? This is just speculation, but it could be that she instinctively understands that a family unit is better suited to bonding into social groups than a lone girl. On the other hand, well, a sentimental sort might suggest she's making up for a perceived lack of love in her quarantined upbringing. Parents' love. Oof. The project was instigated in 2000 as one of several concepts for the company's next best, next generation experimental battlefield superiority initiative, working with technical assistance from HCF to develop a bioweapon for neutralizing combatants in mass with minimal direct contact. Next best was later folded and all its assets diver diverted into this project. What makes this project markedly different from the conventional weapons is its ability to turn enemy combatants into allies, converting hostile elements into willing servants. Since this effectively eliminates the cost of not only POW handling, but also combat itself, it's no wonder we had the blank, and even, even so-and-so's blank, blank organization chomping at the bit to get on board. The project would never have existed were it not for the discovery in blank of blank, the remarkably progressed vicarian evolution fungus that we commonly term um, mutamycete. mutamycete, there we go. The fabrication method for each bioweapon was to introduce the mutamycete uh, genome to a pre-stage 4 human embryo and perform cultivation in a controlled environment for over a period of 38 to 40 weeks. The result organisms were referred to as candidate specimens and graded based on usability from the impractical and faulty. Series A through D to the perfected E series. 
A common appearance was selected for the bioweapon set of roughly that of a roughly ten year old girl to ensure ease of blending in with urban refugee populations. The first E series specimen named Evelyn has proven capable of secreting the mutamycete um, from her tissue at will. It is also of note that Evelyn's mutamycete imposes a profound control over body and mind when introduced into a host organism. We still have a lot to learn about the mechanisms by which Evelyn achieves and maintains this control, but the working theory is that the vector is similar to autoinducer pheromones used for quorum sensing in Pseudomonas bacteria. Evelyn's control is exerted in a series of discrete stages, the first of which is hallucination. Almost immediately after infection, the subject begins to see images of Evelyn, though she is not in fact there, and hear her voice, which is inaudible to anyone else. Auditions with infected subjects throughout the stages of infection reveal that at first, the phantom Evelyn appears to be a normal young girl, sometimes desiring companionship or assistance. As time progresses, she begins making more and more extreme demands, including self-mutilation and attacks on other people. The psychological shock that induces helps this induces helps to break down the mind's natural barriers to Evelyn's brainwashing effect. And by the time the mental control is achieved, the mutamycete infection has progressed throughout the body's cells, so the body blank. Yeesh. Okay, well. I got a thing. You want a thing? E necrotoxin. Destroy cells of any subject based on the E series bioweapon model. Use only for disposal of E series assets. The toxin must first be stimulated before use. Do this by placing a sample of an E series cells into the necrotoxin container. I do. Um, well, I could take this out and join the ranks there. Um, so are you. I'm okay on health. I really think I'm good with everything I've got, honestly. handgun ammo. Um, I don't know, should I equip the grenade launcher? It feels like it would just be one more thing taking up space, but if I were, uh, but then I'd get rid of the flamethrower. That's at the burner. Launcher out, flame rounds out. Okay. In that case, I probably should have made more flame rounds with that. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Well, that's fine. That's fine. That's cute. Okay, so to make flame rounds, I need strong chemical fluid and solid fuel. I don't have solid fuel anyway, so it wouldn't have worked. Okay. Uh, but I'll take one of these out since I accidentally used one, which is fine. we go with this, my dudes. Okay, let's load up our guns. Cool, I got 
three of those, so that's a last resort. Should I just equip my mag and then just not use it? I didn't get the mag. I don't think I got the mag. No, I think I left it in the thing. That's right. Okay. Some chem fluid. I'd really like some shotgun shells one day. I think we may just try and finish this today. Creepy little girl singing. Love it. Uzuma! Kill her. Die! That's rude. Barely made that. <gasps> Naturally, now I get some shotgun shells. Okay, let's discard you. Discard you. Give me those.
This is it. It's wrapping up. Shit. The wheelchair. Grammy. Grammy, are you lost? Well, fine, the bear. It's not here. It's gone. It's gone. Ooh, subject one. It's Grammy. E series one. Seeing this, Jesus! It's okay. Fuck. It's okay. It's me. I know you oh. hurt me. Kill him, mommy. Oh, but you shouldn't have done that. It fucking hurts. He doesn't want to be my daddy. Then he can die. Rude. Now it's mommy's turn to kill you. I do not much care for your attitude, little lady. Right, Daisy? Why isn't she rude? <laughs> Ooh, stop laughing. He died. One of us. And then maybe you'll play nice. I'm not playing. Get up, buddy.
Get her. A grenade launcher. How do I use that? What do you think, Daisy? Should I use the grenade launcher? Okay. That's how many times I died throughout the whole game. I you say seven times. Down. I died seven times, maybe. Yeesh.
achievement unlocked. End of night. There he is. I'm Redfield. I'm glad we found you. I can't wait to see what the fuck his position is in the next the game. Fuck took you guys so long. Yay! I think this took what seven episodes? Ethan? You guys still fucking alive? Yeah. You made it. I'm glad. Did but I? seriously, we need a divorce. They say that when one door closes, another opens. Well, a door closed tonight. And what a long night it was. But not just for me. Me and I weren't the only victims here. So were the Bakers. It was that thing, Evelyn, who made them that way. But now Evelyn's dead. And these guys are here to clean up the mess. I had just come to terms with losing Mia. But now she's back and wants to start over. Put all this behind us. Maybe this is where the next door opens. I get flagged for copyright music. <sighs> Guess we'll skip it. I'm trying to decide if I try and do another series before Village comes out. I want to do Alice Madness Returns because I just freaking love that game. I'll just do it on like Game Plus that way I have all the weapons and all the upgrades and stuff and I can just kind of breeze through it but might be fun. Okay. Restarts. Four. Everywhere is destroyed. 13 out of 20. Antique coins. 12 out of 18. Files obtained. 28 out of 32. Item boxes open. 88. Healings used. 20. Stabilizers used. 1. Steroids used. 2. Fun game, honestly. Some good shit right there. Should we see what this is all about? Resi Village. Go to the online store. Ah, okay. That's just if you want to see a trailer. But hey, we did it! We beat Resident Evil 7 in it, like, just pretty consistently, like, an hour each episode or so. Give or take, plus or minus a few minutes. 
Uh, thank you so much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed it. I think I'm gonna go ahead and do Alice the Madness Returns next. It's just a good game, something fun. It's a beautiful looking game. The combat's incredible, so do that. Do us a little something, and then Resident Evil Village will be here before we know it. Uh, so thanks so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye!